Right everyone, welcome back to here. Right, I was tagged by Londinium Armoury to do a video on your best knife and flashlight combo for under 40 quid or 40 dollars. This is a tag video. It's an open tag, so if you want to join in this, please do. And I will tag a couple of people at the end. You'll know who they are because their name will be in the title. So I guarantee that they see it. Um, so yeah, the idea of this is to pick a knife and a flashlight under 40 quid or under 40 dollars. Um, I would say I've definitely got combinations of that. But some of the knives and torches you can't buy for those prices anymore. So I'm not going to include those. I'm only going to include a set that you can still buy right now, today, for less than 40 quid. I'll show you my actual picks and I'll show you a couple of other combinations which I reckon would be good if you could still get them. So, straight away, my pick is the Lansky World Legal and the TI3 from Through Night. This whole combination would be less than 40 quid. 23 quid at most, 20, 23 quid for the Lansky and 15 quid for the TI3. So if you've never seen the Lansky World Legal, it is a rather big UK legal slip joint knife. I say rather big, you know, it is UK legal, but if you compared this to other UK legal knives, it would make them look small. But this is a perfectly legal knife you know, as the name says, world legal. Slightly unusual looking knife, and I'll be honest with you, for years I used to look at this and think, nah, I don't like the look of that. But when I was bought one for a birthday present, I changed my mind completely. Once you get one of these, yeah, it's a completely different story. And yeah, the fact that you can get this for 23 quid, I think it's amazing when you see the quality of this knife. The blade is 9CR18MOV, Perfectly legal, very good um, tight slip joint on it, half stop there, but yeah this is quite hard to actually open and close but that's a good thing. Really good build quality and overall a lot of knife for 20 quid. And I've checked this, you can still get these for 20, 23 quid as well. Nice four position pocket clip as well, because I know some people are a bit funny about their pocket clips. And the other thing I like about this a lot is it fits your whole hand. Because the problem with a lot of UK legal knives, they will not fit your whole hand on. Because the handle is in comparison to the blade, which means they end up having quite a small handle. Whereas, yeah, this does actually fit your hand nicely. For the price, very, very, very good knife. Just a bit unusual looking. So that's the knife. And then you get the torch. So this, I haven't actually got a full TI3 at the minute. This is the body of a TI3 with a TI. So essentially what this is, this head is a titanium version of the TI. I lost the head to my aluminium version. But yeah, the, the TI3 is the aluminium version of this. This is the aluminium body with a titanium head. But it will represent the exact same flashlight. It's just it would be all black. But it would have the exact same features, it's just the head wouldn't be titanium. So, small flashlight. I've struggled mostly with flashlights because I've got quite a few flashlights. But getting one for under 20 quid that's any good is actually reasonably difficult. And ones that I've got. Obviously there's loads and loads and loads of good um, 20 quid or less flashlights. I don't have any of them though. The only ones I've got I either don't think they're that good. They either don't come with a battery or you just can't buy them anymore. So the TI3... Very small little AAA battery flashlight, removable pocket clip, aluminium body, four modes. So it has 
you just screw the top to get the light on. It has a moonlight setting, Let's twist it and do it again, low and then a high, back to the moonlight and if you do a double you get a strobe. So it has the four settings in a little flashlight like that. I think that's quite good. But that is, that's definitely the best combination for 40 quid that I have. Now I'll show you some of the things that could replace this if you could still buy them at the price you could. So you can get a lot of flashlights like this. This is the Four Fire VG15S. And you can actually get this flashlight for about 15 quid. I say you can, you could get them for about that price. You can't get them for that anymore. So I didn't include this because if I did and you searched it online, you wouldn't actually be able to get it. But these were originally about 15, 20 quid. And that would be an absolutely amazing combo, those two. But seeing as this you can't buy online, I've had to go with the TI-10, which you can actually buy today if you want to. Same thing with the Ganzo G729. This would be an amazing combo, these two. When I bought this knife, it cost me 12 quid. Again, as I said, this is about 15 quid. So that whole combo there would be actually less than 30 quid. But, as I mentioned, try and buy that nowadays, you can't actually get it. Try and buy one of these nowadays, it costs you 30 quid on its own. And now I'm going to show you what would be the best knife flashlight combo ever if it was better quality. Which is this. The Seema flashlight pen knife. I've been searching for a good flashlight knife combo for years. Really, really, really hard to find anything that's any good. You can either find a good knife and it will have a really crap torch or you'll find one with a good torch and a crap knife. This was the best I could ever find and when I first got it, it was reasonably good but the build quality is not that good and the the spring that is essentially the, um, the sort of slip joint for it is a bit too loose. But this is a... Knife combo, it's essentially an 18650 uh, flashlight with multiple modes with a sort of Susano pen knife setup. I wish this was better. I've changed this around. Originally, the torch was this end and the switch was this end, but I changed it so that the knife could be on the actual light end. I think it's slightly more useful that way. The reason this is not very good though is the blades. The sort of slip joint is very, very loose. I may one day take this bolt out and put a rivet in, hammer it over so they're very tight. But you get a, and I also changed the combination of the blades, the blade used to be in the middle. So you get a blade, bottle opener, tin opener, screwdriver with some little spanners there, ruler with um, fist scaler there, metal files and a saw and the light you get a, a low strobe and high yeah if that was better made and you could get them easily I would highly recommend that but the problem is it's not a great quality knife I wish this was better because it would actually be my ideal thing. The reason I changed the light around as well is because if the light actually faces the tools at night you could actually use it in the dark. Whereas if the light's the other way around, it's pointing the wrong way. Yeah, 18650 battery for the flashlight. So it's actually a good powerful flashlight that will last a long time as well. Because the other thing is you can get these, you can get similar things to this, but they're either like a massive torch with tiny little blades about this big. You know, this was the this was the best combo I ever found for size and tools and flashlight. But sadly, not all that good. Right, so yeah, there you go. 
Lansky World Legal and the Through Night TI3. Both of those two together around about 35 quid. Maybe a little bit more, but definitely under 40 quid. So I would like to tag Timbo66, Jim M, Captain Electro, XDM50, and Tetsubo57. Anyone else watching this who would like to join in, please do. Let me know in the comments that you're going to join in. And then I can make sure other people get to see your video as well as myself. Don't forget to visit Londinium Armory's channel to see what he picked. He was the one who started this. Thank you, mate, for uh, tagging me. Yeah, there you go. That's the combo that I've got that you could buy today. There probably are better combos, but that's what I've got. All right, hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. See you later.